Hi friends, welcome to Marco Insights. This is Nidhi and in this video, we're going to discuss about customer segmentation models. Customer segmentation is basically a marketing strategy in which we divide the customer base into distinct groups or segments based on shared characteristics like demographics, needs, preferences, etc. Now let's look at the primary objective of doing customer segmentation. Number one is to do targeted marketing. Once you have your specific customer bases, you will be able to personalize your messages and give personalized offers to these customer segments. Number two, improve customer experience. Once you understand the needs and preferences of different customer segments, you will be able to talk to them in their own language and according to their own need. Number three, increase sales and retention. For each customer segment, there is a specific customer journey. When you understand the pain points properly, you will be able to sell more and retain those customers. Number four, efficient resource allocation. Once you understand where your customer is, what the customer is looking for, you will be able to allocate your marketing resources better. Now let's look at the three customer segmentation models. Number one is cluster analysis model. This is the segmentation model in which we describe the customers, we segment the customers basis their characteristics and behaviors. By employing algorithms that analyze data, marketers can create distinct customer clusters with shared traits. These traits could include demographic, purchasing habits, geographic locations, or other relevant data points. Number two is RFM segmentation. RFM stands for recency, frequency, and monetary segmentation. Basically, it is based on customer's transaction history with the company. By segmenting customers according to RFM, marketers can target high-value, loyal customers differently from occasional buyers, enhancing personalization and engagement. Number three is longevity segmentation. Basically, it depends upon the tenure of customer with the brand, that how long the customer has been associated with your brand. It can divide the customers into long-term loyal customers versus the newcomers. This segmentation model is particularly valuable for tailoring communication and offers to nurture customer loyalty. Marketers often find value by combining different segmentation models to find more finer customer segments. For example, merging high value RFM segments with low longevity uh, cost segments actually gives you a customer segment which is highly active for your brand and is recently acquired. It is very important to keep updating your customer segment. Businesses must establish feedback loop. And once you have campaign results, you can refine your customer segments. You can find out the most active subsets of your segments and you can refine your marketing efforts accordingly. So this was all about the customer segmentation models. You can use that to create distinct customer segments for your own brand. If you like this video, please share it with your friends and family. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you do not miss out on any such interesting content in future. See you in the next video. Till then, stay safe and stay healthy. Bye.